guys, welcome to today's vlog. This vlog, if you actually look around, it's it's really very late. It's about 12 a.m. already. I'm starting this vlog like really late at night because we are gonna have a really long day tomorrow and we're going out with Andy and Ryan. Now they have signed all the indemnity forms, we've got all the forms done, so we're really excited. We're gonna go down and we're gonna have fun. I'm not gonna tell you what the activity is yet, but as we go on, you're gonna find out. One of the activities where uh, a lot of you have actually messaged us and said that you know you wanna try it. Unfortunately, it's not something that is easy for everyone to try, so I hope that you have fun as you watch our video. Okay, talking about that, we haven't had dinner and it's already like 12 a.m. Okay, and I've been sick the whole day. Like, I'm actually suffering from food poisoning now, so I'm not sure if you, you can see that I'm actually having a bit of cold sweat, but I can't let others down, so I'm just pushing myself through. Okay, this is for dinner. So that's like egg, fried Maggie, and fried... Oh my gosh, your cook just splashed on me. Still on me. Yeah. Good morning, guys. We are currently on our way to pick Andy and uh, Ryan. Today's activity is going to be actually in the forested area. So, rain doesn't exactly mean good, but rain also means really fun because we're going to get really dirty and you know wet. So, uh, yeah, hopefully everything turns out well today because if the rain is too heavy, we cannot go out, then there will be another problem. Alright, so here we are with what Andy and his brother. What's up? What's up? Hi. Like, finally, they are here. Finally. We were supposed to have like towels and socks and everything. And these people Shut come. Up. And we are really late by half an hour. And they don't even have towels and socks. Like, and like, and we are late by one, more than one hour. We were supposed no, to be no, no, at 8.15. No. Yeah, but we are supposed to reach there by 9. Yeah, okay. So, so we are now half we are an hour late. Yeah, so now we are half an hour late. And you guys don't even have like whatever you need. Exactly. So now we need to go to the market and get that. That's, that's ridiculous. Yep. Hey guys, so here we are now. And we are ready. So this is actually the activity that we have been planning for quite some time, right? Quite some time. How long? Mm. Since NDP actually. Yeah, since NDP. Yeah. There are a lot of people here today. Like there are some people from Malaysia as well as Singapore. And uh, we are going out together. So it's like a bunch of eight of us going out together. We are all dressed up, ready, waiting for them. And then we we'll go for some briefing again. This time we're going to focus a bit more on uh, probably trying to trying to recreate tricks, you know, like donuts and stuff. Like we're going to try to do it. Yeah, so anyway, we are uh, ready. And it's actually a very rainy day. I'm still having a bit of food poisoning, but I think I'm much better. I went to the toilet like at least five times this morning. Seriously. I'm going to do and then if I ever like really? you, eh, not really. Uh. Please no really, okay? You just did a basic thing last time. Uh, like, yeah. like something else other. You go, you go, then the bum right, you go. Boom. Oh, you want to do a jump? Yeah. Okay. Run. Current thoughts. I'm gonna bang Ryan. Very scared because he just said that. <laughs> um, very scared because I don't have that much of experience on a bike. Do you even cycle? Huh? Do you cycle? Yeah. Okay, so basically it's a bicycle. Yeah, but you don't pedal, you have to cycle. Yeah, yeah. So, do you use an e-scooter? Have you used one before? Yeah, yeah. E-scooter, yeah. Yeah, so it's like an e-scooter. Thoughts? Uh, slightly nervous, first time. So, I don't know what to expect. But, I'm actually excited. Like, so, what do you expect to take home from today? Um, today's session? Uh, I want to fall at least once. Oh, oh that will be easy. <laughs> guys, he want to fall at least once. You bring us, yeah. right? Okay, he wants to fall down on the bike. <laughs> he want to fall down. Yeah, he want to fall down on the bike. All right, Hi. so now we are on our way uh, in a vehicle to where we are supposed to start our bike riding session. Uh, and he's taking the front seat. Yeah, good life, guy. Yeah, and then you're leaning all the way back. My gosh. Uh, when yeah, I came in, this like a small ikan bili sardine. Horrible, so bad. When I came in, the seat was really like this. Oh, this. really? Yep. Sure that after this experience, when you rent the bike outside, you'll find it very much easier to control a bike because of the experience. Yeah, 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 because this is really very tough. We went for the ATV down here when we tried the ones outside, it was like super easy. I mean, because in my gosh, your Some goggles are so cool. nice, nice oh, goggles. Yeah. I don't care. 
Cause Gary, but you can control? Yeah, but like, you know, my legs are long and the bike is small, so... That's why I was asking whether you can use the bigger one. Because the bigger one will allow your legs to straighten up. Ryan, the moment you fall down, the first thing you do is to cut the engine. That is the most important thing, I because if you don't cut the engine and the wheel continues spinning, if you have any loose ends, you'll just get sucked in, okay? okay? Now he's trying the automatic one. This has no need for using the clutch when you change gear. So you're just going around with the automatic one. This may look like a place with just a lot of trees but if you actually look deeper into the forest like beneath the grass you'll be surprised to see certain things one of the things i saw is down here look i just found a rat within this area so not sure if i can show you clearer but this is a huge rat and somehow it died here right so looks like it just died recently because you don't see any prey or like any injury marks you know it's not like it had been attacked there are snails snails kind of eat these kind of things and uh, another area that you actually see you also see lots of uh, things like uh, weird creatures like weird frogs black frogs you see lots of creatures like black frogs and weird snails which i haven't even seen myself before yeah look at that i don't even know what this is but this is amazing the greatest discomfort if you ask me is actually the boots i mean i have no idea why but at the sides here there's something that's just pressing in on your leg so it actually feels uncomfortable a bit pain uh, but you get used to it i mean you just feel like it really protects your leg really well so you accept it now the guys are actually practicing their rounds now uh yeah they're just going around and around and just taking pictures for them we are now at this place where uh we haven't actually seen this place before but it's really very cool let me show you the view a whole quarry over there and people are just arriving like people are just coming down here oh my gosh they're going in they can go in why didn't we go in Look at this beautiful place, my gosh. Oh, careful. It's a bit hard walking in this area because it's like so slippery. Oh. But it's so amazing, like the view is beautiful. So much better than the, the quarry that we went to the last time. I think the quarry that we went to the last, the last time was actually on the other side. So this is actually the back side of it. Look, all the dirt bikes just lined up here. These guys are like experienced riders, I think, because they are allowed to come to these kind of areas. Whereas we have to stop from the farm and walk here. The water looks so clean. Ryan, drink the water. Swim. Swim? Yeah, but you sure there's nothing in the water? Well, every day I come here and swim. Every day I come here and swim. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> You mean there's no crocodile or this down here? No, no. Play basso tak? Boleh, basso. You can you can go in by with these boots. What fish? Oh my gosh, water is entering my boots now. Okay. 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 <laughs> oh my gosh, the water here is so clear. Rock skipping, my gosh. <laughs> oh, look, this is good for rock skipping. I'm basically swimming as far as I can. This is pure rainwater. is like the moment of truth the moment of uh, you checking whether you are pretty much ready after the whole day uh, of training with Tristan Park basically you're supposed to go over this uh, this small little stream but because the sand is so extremely soft 
it is really hard uh, you have to control your bike properly basically if you go down too fast or too slow you get stuck okay or you just swerve and, and just crash somewhere else so it really requires a bit of a control on the bike Well done! Garden. Okay, come, come, garden. come, let me know. Garden. Opinions, opinions. Wow, it's actually a great experience. Like, honestly, I never thought it would be this fun. I thought it would be like really boring, slow riding. But once I really pulled the throttle, like, it was actually pretty enjoyable. I don't mind coming back here. Yes. Yeah, I come would really here. recommend everyone to come here, seriously. You come must back. hug, you must hug your bang. Foto. Makasih, bang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, bang want to, bang want to go home already. Bang don't want. Main main je, bang main main je. Bang ni boleh ride balik tak? Tak kau. Jalan ni banyak polis. Terima kasih bang. Tua tua. Brian, your turn. Opinions of today. Fun. Much more than expected. Okay, wait. Let me ask you a question. Fell down more than I expected. How do you feel when you fell down? Which one? I fell down. Like like all the times when you fell, was there like a specific feeling that you be like angry? Sad, happy, depressed. excited. Depressed. <laughs> you know, I wanted to fall down once today. You didn't fall? I fell twice. Okay. You can't stay. No, you can't stay. Oh, no, we can't stay. Yeah. We gotta go, unfortunately. Yeah, we have to go. Oh, go Willy, one for the team. Woo! Thank you, Jeff. Welcome. Can we sit here? Andy, going uh, and, back? And, uh, going back. Oh, cannot. <laughs> cannot. Uh. Andy, lie down. Lah. This one, this one, this one can. Uh. This one like whale. Jangan dengar kata dia. Jangan dengar kata dia. Jangan dengar kata dia. Kita buat kat mana dia? Okay, okay. Alright.
right, Andy is unable to squeeze into this uh, huge area, so and he has to sit in front. Into that. Okay. It's not as comfortable as it seems. It's uh, 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 my back is feeling hurt. Uh, we are actually at the back of this pickup. Windy and cold. Andy's up ahead because he can't squeeze in here. And there's only enough space for either one of him or three of us, so we decided three of us will come in here. Right? Yeah, and, we, and he can't squeeze in here. Exactly. He can't squeeze. We can't squeeze in there, he can't squeeze in here. I know what to say. Yes. You guys are wet because you are sweaty. I am wet because I fell in the water a lot of times. Feel the suspension when Andy comes off. I'm just going to put a camera here and the camera is going to see the whole thing. Just Okay, he's coming off, he's coming off. <laughs> you feel it, you feel it. Oh, I just felt it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you felt it, right? You felt it. This is why, right? This is why, Andy, let me, let me your phone. Look, this is Andy with his ASV cover, okay? After the dirt bike, right? Dirt bike riding, it looks perfectly good. It was yep. also with him. And my phone I don't regret. My but without the ASV cover, let's have a look at this. Ryan, tell us what happened to your phone. <laughs> Basically, the bag got dented also. How do you and even get this bin there? Like, I don't know. My gosh. Because this, this. because this thing is somewhere here, right? So uh -huh. when I crash, my body hit the tip of the shaft. So what what actually caused this din Most likely the bicycle, the motorbike. Uh. The motorbike. The bicycle. Right. bicycle. And the screen. Show us the screen. My god. It's already cracked. You can see. Definitely. Oh, you can't even see anything now. Hi, can I text my mom on this? Yeah. Oh no, I, I can, can't. I can turn it on. What I is the what is the lesson of the day, Ryan? Um. A what about the ASP cover? <laughs> Yeah. Get an ASB cover. Get an ASB cover. cover. <laughs> Let's have a look at your phone. Mine? Mine is somewhere in there. Is it okay? Yeah, it's okay. Apart from some sand and some dirt, it's fine. Oh, you're putting a and It's still usable. Mine is here. Ma. Perfectly okay. Perfect. Yeah. Honestly, like, you know, you would expect if someone ran, ran away your food with a freaking motorbike, you yeah. would really feel something, right? Yeah. Like, it would be painful. But when he ran over my foot, I didn't actually feel anything. Like, at all, I practically felt attacked. I knew he ran over my foot, but it wasn't painful. I think the most important actually is the steel Alright, so here we are after the whole dirt bike session and uh, we have like two really very happy, actually everyone is really happy but it's their first experience and they're like so happy to this whole experience, like super excited. This is like one of the best experiences ever in their life. 6.44, it's time for dinner. Alright guys, last night we came back and it was really so late. Like Andy and Ryan, uh, we had our buffet at Seoul Garden and after that we were so tired they reached back I think like around 11 plus or maybe 12 yeah so we we managed to finally sleep at around 12 30 and you know I'm having like a bit of this stomach flu I woke up at least twice last night and I'm just not feeling that well so anyway I was too tired to end the vlog and I'm actually ending it now I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog thank you so much for joining us and uh, we're going out now we're gonna have another great day so stay cool stay awesome and be your best always.